All right, welcome back, everyone. Well, you would think with thousands of delegates descending on Manhattan next week, the cabbies would be going gaga. They're not. John McDonough now has been driving a cab in the Big Apple since 1977 and says that next week is going to be the biggest mess he's ever seen. So, John, you're not too psyched. Why not? Well, uh, because of all these so-called security precautions that are going around Manhattan and diverting the traffic everywhere, and I think uh, Bloomberg is set up where uh, some of the delegates will be able to come in from the airports for free. We just wish that uh, they use some of the money that they have from the war profits from Halliburton and Bechtel and do a little trickle-down economy down to the cab drivers. All right, so I take it you're not a fan of the Republicans. No, we're organizing a protest against Republicans. We're asking cab drivers to turn their lights on and shine the light on Bush and all also, passengers getting into the yellow taxis to ask the driver to turn on the headlights and do a protest for the four days that the Republicans are in town. What if they already have daytime running lights anyway? I guess uh, none of the cabs. They're Crown they Victorias. Okay. There's 11,000 of them. They don't have the lights on. So if you do see a cab uh, during those four days with the lights on, it'll be there protesting the Bush administration and his policies probably in Iraq. So there were no similar uh, protests like this when the Democrats gathered in Boston? Uh, I drive out of New York. I don't know what they were doing up in Boston. But this is what we're organizing here in New York City. All right, John, w would you pick up a Republican delegate if he or she needed a ride? Oh, of course. And yeah. also, we're giving out a free coupon to anybody that wants to fight the war in Iraq. Uh, if they get that patriotic fervor during a convention, we'll give them a free ride to the airport uh, if they want to go to Baghdad and fight for my freedom. I think it'll be a very worthy cause. It'll help us to help the war uh, situation. And we'll be glad to take anyone to the airport that wants to fight on my behalf. John, is there anything this president has done that you like? Uh, not in the last four years. And I don't okay. want to see him in the next four years. All right, well, you made that abundantly clear. John, thank you for coming. We appreciate it. No problem.